Aries or first house cross watcher. Ooh, now you got the Ace of Sword in the reverse. This is the inner knowing, right? <clears throat> the Ace of Sword in the upright came out before this. This is about cutting through the bullshit, cutting down the, the karmic soulmates. Karmic soulmates are the negative ones that are going to latch on and try to feed your energy, or, or feed from your energy, I should say. Acting as a distraction. You don't really feel the vibe. If you don't really feel the vibe, that speaks louder than anything, okay? So that's the truth. And you are cutting yourself down from hanging around people that you're not vibing with. Right? The vibe is not the, the vibe is not the tribe if the vibe is not right. So the ace in the reverse. Right? Okay, the, let's talk about the ace in the upright. Aries or first house crossroads, right? This is Jupiter. When the when the spade is in the upright, it's Jupiter, right? When it's in the reverse like this. Right, the reverse, this is the upright, and this is the reverse, this is Saturn, right? So you have an inner knowing that your discipline is gonna pay off. This is also the discipline of Saturn, the devil card, because it's restriction similar as the hangman. Woo, we got a good one today. Your inner knowing that this is gonna pay you off. The knight of sword is the manifestation coming through, coming through, coming through. It's looking for you, look, it's looking through the peephole, right? It's scoping you out. It's saying, I see you, because you're resonant in the same frequency, the same suit. And that's another interpretation. I just recently, in this moment, as I said that there, that I just applied to being of the similar suit is a similar frequency. It's like playing music in the similar key. So this knight knows, it's, a, it's, it's on behalf of the divine almost, right? Just like you could say that something negative is on behalf of, um, you know, uh, the devil or whatever, if you want to talk in those terms. This is on behalf of the divine because its sole purpose is to bring you this blessing, this gift, this reward right here because you're resonating in the truth and the truth sets you free. So what's the truth? The truth is you're worth it. The truth is you're worthy. You're doing it, you already did it, and you're just resonating in this fun, loving field of re receiving that blessing as uh, external manifestation in your 3D reality. Now remember, this is the heart being crucified. This is the cross. This is Saturn. So you may have, have to have been a sacrifice like St. Peter when he's... Um, nailed to the tree upside down, the hangman. But it's going to pay off because it's going to be your comeback, your resurrection. Right? And this manifestation will come to cut you down from this hangman position. And what is it? It is um your comeback, your growth, and your expansion with Jupiter in the upright here. Okay. Anything else here, Spirit, that we want to speak to? I do see some bat iconography here. The bats go in the cave, right? That's how it kind of looks here. Around this spade are little bats they look like. You can't really see it, but it looks like they're going into the bat cave. Okay, but then they eventually got to come out. So you're receiving the bat signal, right? You feel like you're Batman coming out of the cave when you're summoned, okay? Very beautiful imagery here. And you will be summoned, you will be called upon. And you're gonna, this is also uh, Yannick and Phallic symbology. Right? This is phallic, this is yonic, so it's a perfect match. It's a match made in heaven. This guy came out earlier with the king of swords and the queen of swords. Okay. So it's almost as if spirit has been marinating you, right? Four, four, four on the clock for this exact moment. I'm hearing this magic moment. So if you feel like you've been on the sideline as far as the dating game or whatever that's what this is coming through here 
then they are going to be well worth the wait because you would be prepared in this suspended state to be the best version of yourself for this magic moment. 5.05 on the clock. Uh, let's roll this on over to Taurus. Reach out for more. 